What's up guys? We are back with a vlog. A long time no see. Sorry been delayed on the video. It's been busy. But we are back in the water. Check this out. I launched the boat. I don't know if you guys remember this guy, Mr. Payred, Payred. What's up, Payred? Good morning. We're gonna do some deep drops today. Uh, we're gonna head up north and see what we can get. So stay tuned and let's do this. We are in the water. We got my buddy Joe right here. Yo, yo. Remember him? We're gonna do some deep drops. See what happens. We got some calm weather today and tomorrow maybe. So take advantage of this again. I think summer's creeping up on us really closely, huh? What do you think? Oh yeah. Freaking calm water. So we're gonna try and take advantage of it again and see if we can pay rent, pay rent, pay rent. Okay, so we are here. Water is flat as a lake. Can't complain. I mean, the only complaint is super hot, but conditions look good. Kind of scout around here and try and see if we can get a drop, uh, a fish on this drop here. So we'll have to wait and see. See what's next. Or we're waiting here for the line to get to the bottom. On my last video, kind of turned me on to something. I noticed people were commenting like where they were from and stuff, but. Put down below where you guys are from. I'm very curious to know where you guys are watching from. I know I got a lot of guys from the US and the mainland. But yeah, just curious. If you guys are new here, please subscribe. Um, it's summertime, so we're hoping to get more content your way. And um, do me a favor and hit the thumbs up. And if it's your first time here, welcome up. <laughs> nah, 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 nah. Looks like we got a bite. I don't know what it is. Might be something small, nothing too big. See what we can get, pull up here. Oh yeah, another spider. Sorry the GoPro froze up, but we got we got him in, check it out. Got one in the box. Pay red, pay red. Phew. We got rid of the bananas though. <laughs> <laughs> what you think? Is it the banana or what? It was the banana. Oh no. The banana was overripe. See, if it's overripe, he said you can't, it doesn't, it doesn't work. So you gotta eat them. So bananas are gone, fish is in the box and we're just getting started. So let's go and get some more. Check this out, we got a wahoo on the surface right here. Coming at us. Coming to your bait. Yeah, trying to see if we can get this rat wahoo. It's right there. I hope you can see it. It's checking it out. It's checking it out. It's right there. See the tail coming out of the water? There. I think we should throw something whole. Come, come, come. Come, come, come. Oh, he scared him up. 
Oh, there he is. He's coming back. Let him come in. He's going to eat it. He's going to eat it. Here, here, here. I learned this from Candy Adventures. Watch this. I don't know. It's a rat wahoo. Boom, boom. Let him boom. swallow it. Let him swallow it. Oh, he's shaking it out. He doesn't want it. Eat it, baby. Eat it. It's gonna eat it. Uh oh. He outsmarted us here, guys. I think if we had a spear gun, this guy would be dead. Guarantee. Yeah, that would be dead. Three, not three. That was three. Guarantee four, five, this thing would be dead. Yeah. If I had a spear gun here. Oh, here we go. Here we go. I'm coming up, but it looks like we got another one over here. Hey, Red. Yeah, you. Hey, Red. Yeah, hey, you. Red. All oh, best job. Let's go. Double up. Double or nothing. Here we go. Yours is bigger than mine for sure. That's what you said. Yeah. <laughs> you sir? Yeah. See what we got, what we got here. Little A hey, Hoover, we'll take them. Hey Red, we got a nice steamer right here. Hi there. Tim? Yep, Tim coming up. Oh coming yeah. Up. Favorite, favorite. Favorite, baby. Is that a wahoo? Yeah, 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 yeah. Big wahoo down there chasing it. Uh. Look at that wahoo right there chasing it over there. Wow, check that out. Wow, dude, nice yeah. one, dude. Woo! Hold that up, hold that up. Woo! Nice fish, bro. Nice. You feed it. All right, guys, we got him. I think the bite's gonna start turning on now, so we're gonna hang out here, see what we can fill this box up with some more reds. Yeah, boy. Action Jackson, right there. All right, shark. Never pressure. do this in Guam, man. Only the Brody. Hold on, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Woohoo! <laughs> so if you don't know this spot, it's probably one of the most sharkiest spots on Guam, but it's hot, so we gotta cool off. Ready? Go! No, no, no way. I got you. I got you back. I'm uh, coming up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Woo go, go, go. <laughs> hey, if you don't like sharks, I don't blame you, man. Like me. Don't worry bro, I don't see anything here. <laughs> That's the problem, you don't see anything. <laughs> hey, it's hot man. It's hot bro, you gotta do it bro. Hey, you're wasting my camera battery, so hurry up. Bro! <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> How's that feel? <sighs> What's that? What's that behind you? What's that? <laughs> it's a, something gray back here. <laughs> Ron again, Ron again. Look at the big one. Oh no. Shark? No. That might be shark. Yep. You got shark. Why do you got shark here? Pretty deep, like 120 meters. But you guys saw that, it just kind of stopped and then now it's coming up freely. Dang it. I got a head coming up. 
And yep. Oh, shark right below us. Still got some meat on there. Dang, man, look at that. Right below us. Oh, that's an oceanic white tip. Or a silver tip. Right behind us. Alright, well, we lost most of the fish. As you can see. It looks like a silver tip or oceanic white tip. It had white tips on the uh, dorsal and the uh, pectorals. Yep, tax season. I paid taxes already, but I, st I still pay taxes even after I paid taxes. It's coming up. Jim? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Go in a circle. Here, here, nice one. Big one, dude. Big one. Big one. Oh, yeah, baby. Big, big one. Oh, yeah. Look at that thing. Nice one, bro. Big red. Big red. Got a pretty big hit right here. Oh yeah, yeah, right there. Still there, still there. Still there. Let's see if we can get a get this guy up. He was actually running the other way. He was taking line, so I don't know. What way was she running? Up, down, right? Left, right, up, down. Oh yeah. <laughs> right now he's coming up, right? Oh yeah. He wasn't going up, he was going the other way, but it's pretty big, so... Up there, baby! Big one. Yellow, yellow! Oh, super them out. Big lady. Big lady, big star, guys. Yeah! Monster lady. Look at that Leahy. Big one. Good job there, buddy. Yeah. Thank you. That wraps up a beautiful fishing day on the island of Guam. Going high, tag team, did some deep drops. We had a good time. Takes a lot of patience, but we got some really good fish to eat. Hope you guys enjoy that. If you guys hit the thumbs up, I might consider doing a catch and cook. So do me a favor, hit the thumbs up. Thanks guys for coming along. We're gonna head back in and enjoy this beautiful sunset. Well, we're in the kitchen. Thanks guys for coming along with that. That was a great trip. Um, I'm gonna do a catch and cook just for all my subscribers out there. And if you're not subscribed, please do so right now because we're gonna get right into some really good cooking action here. So. So you guys saw we got some monaga, so we're gonna cook some monaga. So I don't like to waste anything on my fish, so we're keeping the collars, the comma. Um, then we have a couple heads that we're gonna make a miso soup out of this. So a little traditional Japanese dish, miso paste. And this was actually the one you guys saw with the shark bite that had it. So we're gonna salvage some of the meat off of this and add it to the soup. So first things first, we are going to make a dashi. And dashi is basically a base for many Japanese dishes. It derives from um, a little bit of katsu bushi or like shaved bonito flakes, a little bit of kombu or kelp. But instead we're gonna make our own kind of like a fish stock or fish broth with the heads. So I'm gonna go ahead and add that to boiling water and then add some kombu. And then we're gonna, what we're gonna do is we're gonna strain it and then keep some of the meat parts off of it, take it out. And then I'm gonna make the miso soup and then add it back in with other ingredients. So let's get right to this. Okay, so we're gonna add our fish heads to the steeping water. Just like that. And we're gonna kinda cook it down just for a few minutes just to harden up the meat. And then we'll pull it out, take off some of the meat parts. And then we'll add the head right back into it. So we basically, we took out as much meat as we could put in a separate bowl 
and then I added the heads right back in. So now the idea here is to get like a nice clear soup or a clear dashi. It won't be as clear as like a consomme, but we're gonna go ahead and start skimming all the white stuff off the surface. So it's gonna excrete as much white as it'll give us, but we wanna get rid of that. So just kinda just go along the edges and just get rid of all the white. You wanna cook it at a low heat, almost kind of like a lazy boil, where it's just slowly bubbling. That way it doesn't really, it makes it easier for you to skim as well. So just keep on doing that for about, so this thing is cooked maybe about another 15 more minutes. Fish cooks pretty quick, so. So we have our broth ready to go. Um, we are going to use a white miso, which we got locally at Tokyo Mart. And the trick to this is you don't want it to clump, so we're gonna go ahead and mix some in a bowl with some hot broth. So we'll grab a good generous amount here of miso. That should be good for now. Then we're gonna whisk it. We're gonna go ahead and incorporate it nice and gently. And then we'll add it right back into the broth. Okay, so now we got our miso soup broth going. I'm going to add the onaga pieces. Just gently add them to the pot. Okay, so the onaga is probably cooked by now, but we're gonna go ahead and add some baby clams to this, give it a little bit more flavor. Love having some clams in my miso soup. These are already cooked, so I'm gonna add them last. Then we're gonna go ahead and add our other ingredients, our wakame, which is the seaweed. I'm gonna add some of that to it. I'll add the silken tofu in our bowl so it doesn't get all broken up. So you just, we'll just add some right on top of it. Okay, so it's pretty much done. But we're gonna do something out of the ordinary. I don't know if I'm breaking any kind of rule or anything, but we're gonna add some udon noodles. I had some leftover udon noodles in our freezer, so I didn't wanna waste it. So I boiled some up here. And then now we're gonna turn on the heat on this guy. Try to grab a little bit of everything in here. So some mushroom. Chunk of onaga, some wakame seaweed. And where's the cur the clams? They're down there. Just like that. Then a little bit of green onions on the side. Then lastly, we saved our fish that we dug out from the head. I'm gonna pile some of that right there in the middle. Just like that. Okay, well, I think making the dashi or the broth took the longest part, but you know, instead of using an instant dashi, I wanted to not waste the bones, use the flavor from the fish and not waste anything at all and make our own dashi. So that was basically the base of the miso soup. And then you guys saw it, so let's give it a try. Let's get a little bit of this meat in there. Hmm. Let's try the broth. A little bit of tofu. Hmm. Really nice. That's a really nice miso paste that I got. It's a white miso paste. There's like, I don't know the difference between all the miso paste. There's probably like 20 on the shelf, but hey, the lady said the white one was pretty good, so good choice. Oh yeah, perfect on this nice cold day in Guam. Anyways, well, thanks guys for coming along and watching. Um, I had a good time. Joe is, Joe is with me. He's always a great time on the boat. But we got some nice fish. We got some quality fish like Onaga. And uh, we hope to get you some more videos out this summer. But thanks guys. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button. Smash the thumbs up. And we'll see you guys on the next one. All right. Shoots. Mmm. <laughs> Champion. Champion. Open a restaurant or what? <clears throat> Wait, I can answer that. It's too good. <laughs>